Hello class 4 students. I hope you are all doing well. Today we are going to start with the chapter 15 that is people in India. And the main points are population of India, languages, festivals and food in India, unity in diversity. So let's start. Write the name of the states where it is celebrated. First, Bihu. Second, Besakhi. Third, Pongal. Fourth, Onam. You have to write the states where these festivals are celebrated. India is a very big country. It has a large population. They live in different parts of India. People of different states speak in different languages, wear different types of clothes, eat different food and celebrate different festivals. These people have different traditions and culture. For this reason, India is called the land of rich culture and heritage. These differences make India a unique country. Now, population of India. At present, the population of India is said to be nearly 135 crores or 1.35 billion. Population of a country is the number of the people living in this country. Our population is increasing every day. But population in each area is not the same. For example, the population of the mountains and deserts are much less than the people living in the plains and coastal areas. Now, languages in India. Hindi is the official language of our country. Our constitution mentions 22 languages, including Hindi. Among them, some languages are spoken in different states of North India and others are South Indian languages. Sanskrit and Tamil are the oldest languages of India. Most of the Indian languages are written from left to right, but some languages like Urdu, Kashmiri and Sindhi are written and read from right to left. Assamese, Bengalis, Gujarati, Kannada, Kashmiri, Malayalam, Manipur, Marathi, Odia, Punjabi, Sindhi, Telugu, Santhali, Maithili and Dogri also mentioned in our constitution. Festivals in India Festivals are a time of celebration and having fun. People of India are followers of different religions. Hindus, Muslims, Sikh, Christian, Buddhist, Jains, etc. are different religious groups. They celebrate different religion festivals. The main religion festivals are Holi, Dashera, Diwali, Eid, Guru Purab and Christmas. Some festivals are celebrated in some specific states. For example, Ganesh Chaturthi is celebrated in Maharashtra and Chhat is celebrated in Bihar. Durga Puja is celebrated in all parts of North India, but in the West Bengal, it is celebrated with great joy. Here you can see in the pictures, people are celebrating Holi, Eid, Guru Purab and Christmas. Bihu, Besakhi, Pongal and Onam are the harvest festivals of Assam, Punjab, Tamil Nadu and Kerala respectively. Independence Day, Republic Day and Gandhi Janti are the national festivals of India. A grand parade is held on the Rajpath in New Delhi on the Republic Day of India. Here you can see the picture of Republic Day parade. Now, our food. People of different states of our country eat different kinds of food. For example, Chore Bhature, Rajma Chawal and Paneer are popular foods of Punjab, Haryana etc. Fish curry and rice are eaten in the eastern and northeastern states and in coastal regions also. Dal Bati Churma is the popular food of Rajasthan and Jogla, Thepla and Khandvi are popular in Gujarat. South Indians like to eat idli, dosa, sambar, bada, etc. For example, soft bamboo shoots are cooked in northeastern states. Groundnut oil is used in northern India. Mustard oil is used in eastern India. And coconut oil is used for cooking in south India. Here you can see the picture of Dal Bati Churma, Chawal Rajma and Idli Sambar. Now, unity in diversity. We have read about the diversity among the people of India related to food, clothes, festivals, religions and culture. But we are all citizens of one nation, India. We all celebrate our national festivals together. We also share happiness of each other's festivals. We are united by the same national symbol national anthem and national song. We all fought together to make our country independent. Our constitution provides us the same rights. Law and rules are the same for everyone. So, we all stand together. 
there is unity in us in diversity. Now it's time for valued fact. We should share each other's feelings. Now, awesome fact, at the time of need, we forgot our differences. Now let's learn new words. Heritage, anything received from the old generation. Diversity, differences. Unity, keeping together. Now kids, let's remember, India is a big country with a population of nearby 135 crores. We have 22 languages mentioned in our constitution. Hindi is the official language of India. To celebrate different types of festivals, religious, harvest and national festivals. People of different states like to eat different kinds of food. In India, there is unity in diversity. I hope you all like this session. Now we will meet in the next class. Till then, bye-bye.